been in to dent to dent to dent guys playing Jazz Quest some more. Guys, Jazz Quest 2. You got, you got Jazz Quest 1. Uh, you got Jazz Quest 2. Come back from his like, calling us Flintwood Killers. Yeah, but everyone likes Flintwood Killers. Where's my parade? Dude. Can't... So you said you don't know Space really. Space Diner. You don't really know much about Jazz Quest 2. I, I just didn't remember it. I remember, I have much more vivid memories of the first one. I have to sneeze you know, directly on the oh. microphone. Okay, now the sneeze, the sneeze has has dissipated, guys. Good. We've got to spoon you should up. Look some... at, you should look at a bright light. Well, why? Why should I? Because I'll make you sneeze. Thank you. I talked to somebody one time who said, "Makes you stop sneezing." Looking at a bright light, if you have to sneeze, makes you not sneeze. I was like, "What are you talking about?" Yeah, that seems that seems wrong. Look at uh, guy. That guy's horrifying. What? Not that weird. What's his body? Is he a hamburger man? No, he's clearly like a Kix. Or something like that. I, mean, I would expect uh, Kix to be a kid, but I appreciate that. Or a mom. Yeah, d well, no. Dude, uh, look how big these booths are, though. They're probably fitting five, uh, six Chex men in there. Yeah, exactly. Pro probably about that. Tables, I feel, are the exact right height, though. For that table. For, no, for, for the benches, yeah. I got I got a feeling that uh, Chex Man's a little short. Maybe. It's fine. There's nothing wrong with being a short man. These jerkwads. I don't know anything. I don't know anything about those things. They look scary. That's all you need to know. No, that much was readily apparent. Like we were all like, "Oh, what's that weird thing doing there?" And it was bad. The H H H International. What's H H H stand for? Where? I didn't see H H H. It's on the door. Uh, it's the who. The. <laughs> Not just baseball. Exactly. <laughs> Doesn't even see me. I'm surprised you could shoot through the grate. Uh, what, what are those jerkwads doing? Look at them. Yeah. They're so big and scary. They're unbelievably unhittable. How is Chex's man even gonna. I think they're gonna come down when you do this. Really easy to celebrate, bro. Thank you. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, those, guys are, those guys are real big and scary. That I'm going to give you right now. Anytime they make that noise, it's always bad. No. All right, so now we're going to do the classic. That's stuff of nightmares. Oh, God, he's right in front of me. Yeah, that didn't work out at all, for the plan. It did in that I killed him and his friends. Well, in, in that respect, it totally did. Yeah, you're screwing with these dudes. Oh, there's another one. That's clearly uh, oh, God. ramping up the difficulty by a tremendous degree. Ugh. Okay, well, that, it didn't look that difficult when you did it that time. Yeah, that's like a billion health. I wonder if I can go up here. I would have assumed you had to. Apparently not. But I did get this thing. That'll help. You got all the Zorch you can handle. I would like more Zorch. That's true. Could, could someone hook me up with a little more Zorch? I don't little, have any ammo for anything. Which you want to Zorch us up a bit? Yeah, you're going to have to get some real spooning in. There's no question about that. Get some Zorch up here. Get some Zorch in this coffee. <laughs> yeah, look, at, look at Chexman's shifty eyes. Well, dude, if you're Chexman... No, he's like always on like the ready. He's No, he's paranoid, dude. You're in hostile territory. You know when a flamboy is going to come after be. you. This is Czech City. I can't believe, can't believe they've gotten this far. They've gotten this far, dude. That was the ending of the last game. They told you about how the invasion was not just on that planet. Yeah, I know, but it's just, it's just, I never thought it'd be the, real. The threat is real. I never thought it'd be, it'd be this real. Now, how effective is the spoon? Less... You want, you want the spoon to be like a, not an instant kill, but an almost instant. kill. Uh, the, the, the spork is better, obviously. Obviously. Um. But is it like, is it like on par with the initial pistol? Probably. I mean, it's like two, it's like probably two hits on your average dude. I can dig that. That's a respectable spoon. Yeah, but the spork. It's also the name of my. Spork's where the money's at. Super random uh, forum name. What was the name of it? Oh, I forgot. Respectable what. spoon. Respectable spoon. All right, jerks. Can I you, call you jerks? You've proven the the, sp the spoon. You've proven it. 
That's nice. They got the double there. It's a pretty nice city. It's got a pyramid and everything. It's got a couple pyramids. If you look. Well, at actually, it. it's got a, this. This is actually a pretty fortunate uh, emplacement here because everywhere you turn, this is a pyramid. Oh yeah, I mean it's like you look straight. That's pyramid one. Pyramid, two. pyramid. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's kind of like I, right I feel in the like center this, of the pyramid. District. I feel like this is kind of like the. Uh, I feel like it's kind of like the Las Vegas of the cereal planet. Yeah, totally. Ooh, still, still got that stuff on his on his gunk. Guys, that's the brains of his enemies. He's just flicking it off, dude. You almost cinema almost hit. You almost hit par on that. I'm a little impressed. Right. I'm a little really impressed. Oh no, they could see where this file is located. Even Oops. I don't know where it's located. Cinema already sounds terrifying. It's gonna be rad. I'm gonna jack up the volume just a little bit so I really get a handle it. So the fear can be real. Dude. Dude. So, it's <clears throat> gonna be something that you don't care about and I don't care about either. Or, I mean, the audience won't care about. Uh, so I'm watching the show, right? A good what friend, Baz, instructed us to Instructed me to watch it. It's called Attack on Titan. It's an animu. Okay. It's really good, dude. What's here's, it about? Dude, here's the thing about it. Like, it's super duper, like... It's... Okay. Dude, look at all the, uh... I love this already. I love it already. Well, no, look at all look at all the... Um, really? I can't get in there? Look at all the textures they used on the first level and last game. Like the blue walls. Yeah, dude. They're little arcades. You got Chomp. You got Blaster. Oh, Blaster's my favorite game. Oh, let's look at these movie posters. You got shark. shark. Sorry. Uh, Minnesota Jack. Yeah, I like that a I'm lot. I'm saying it's Jack. I can't read it. Oh, concession stand full of fruit. Dude, that's, that's healthy. That's a popcorn container. See that? Yeah, up on the counter. Yeah, dude. It's full of popcorn. Anyway, the thing is, it's really, really good. What's it is, about? Okay, so what it is is, humanity has been pushed back to the, uh, to, the, the, Titans all of a sudden invaded the planet, whatever. I think it's probably Earth. Titans being? Massive humans. Okay. But they're, they're like, they're like, almost like zombies, but not really. They're like machines driven only to eat people. And the giant, right? Yeah. The thing is, they look like humans, but they're like... They like don't, uh, they're basically brain dead and only eat stuff, and they're super duper scary looking. But the point is, that doesn't sound like it's up your alley at all. No, it, like you think so. But the thing is, like humanity has been driven back so far that they like only live in walled cities, and like the the first episode starts off with the one wall being totally busted down and like a bunch of titans running in and killing everybody, and it's totally rad. But like, it's so rad. Like I'm imagining that these these zorches. What, sorry, Flemoids are instilling yeah. the same fear that Titans did. You got them. Dude, there's nobody around. Dude. They've evacuated. Like, the smartly. first episode's all, like, about how, like, everyone's just totally, totally in fear and living in terror. That's what I know. The Chex people are, are they're, they've all been eaten, first off. They're dead. Hold on a second. We could all watch Chex Ventura. I'm assuming that's what it says. It's gotta say Chex Ventura. How would you, how would you waste that opportunity? This is oh. about to be good. No, dude, but everyone's dead here. They're all living back in the, in the you know, like, livestock. That's what they say in, in Attack on Titan. The kid's tired of being treated like livestock. For the Titans to eat. Dude, they're watching the movies. So say they're all fucking watching the movie. This is horrifying. These are, these are mass killers. You need to make it your job to eliminate every single Flemoid. Yeah, but look at them. They're just... Or you can avoid them. I, I probably can't. But we'll see if it works. It didn't work. It was a risky gambit. Oh, okay, well, luckily I found the fire exit. Dude, okay, so... Dude, that fire exit was exactly correctly placed. Yeah, right on the street. Well, yeah. Yeah, what yeah, do you think to I Totally. But also, it was at the front. Oh, God, there's a guy behind me. You're a real jerk. What is with these effing... Yo, you're Bazooka Joe here. Those guys need a bazooka. I don't know what we're doing. That was a pro shot. Shot off and then Take you... this, you jerks. That was pretty good. And, and you also jerks. I don't, know, I don't know why they were spared. First time... Dude, we... what song is this? Hold on. Like, it's obviously not that song, but... I know, but get, I'll, I'll figure it out. Dun, 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 Oh, it's... Is it Funky Town? It sounds a little like Funky Town. If it's also Funky Towns, it would also be Cars. 
you know. Yeah. Yeah, that's Funky Town. Yeah, that's Funky Town. Yo, here's a pro tip. I hear Funky Town like every single day on the radio. Really? Yeah, I don't know what the deal is. Dude, the radio's really been stinking it up lately. Guys, I like to listen to the radio to spice it up. Yeah, sometimes. Uh, Ray's been really horse hockey lately, dude. It's like all crap. It's like all crap. I gotta be honest, this is the coolest level in the game so far. Dude, you know how I always feel about first-person shooters and that they should always take place in relatable locations? Yeah. Which is why I'm really upset there's never been a first-person shooter where there was a school location, but they could never do it. Because when I was a kid, I always wanted to be, like, an operative in a school situation. I mean, in, uh... In, Mar in uh, what was it? Modern Warfare 1? 1 or 2. Yeah, you go through a school. Yeah. It's an abandoned school, but close enough. That's what, that's what, it was good enough. But I want, like, a full school situation. Like, how sweet would a map be in, like, a multiplayer game where, like, everyone could just hide a room, like, whatever one they want? No, it would be cool. Dude, on the this topic... Door, this elevator's not happening. Unless it did happen? No. Dude, on the subject of, um... What? Hello? Oh. I don't... There was a jump button. I don't remember what it was. What oh. the... Oh, I think I... There we go. Okay, I think I, I was hitting the ceiling. Really? Yeah, I think it gl glitched out. It's a safety feature. <laughs> it's a good, good. That's a well-made elevator. But yeah, now on the subject of that Titan thing you were talking about... Dude, it's really, really good... I wanted I wanted to Look hate that. it. I know it looks like the one uh, monster from Looney Tunes. I think, okay, the hair, it also, the hair it also yeah, it does. But it also kind of looks like the um, the image for uh, Super Meat Boy. Absolutely, it does. Uh, that picture always makes me laugh or smile. You secretly least. like Super Meat Boy uh, on lore, not on the game. The game's all right, but you love the music and well, I love the music. And I just and love imagery. I just love yeah, I just love Super Meat love Boy. The I think pageantry of Super Meat yeah, Boy. Yeah, there you go. But yeah, um, on the subject of that kind of thing, I saw a, um, can I go in here? No. I saw a preview for World War Z. Movie looks crazy. Like, super crazy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Now some people are getting nipped. No, I saw some previews for World War Z. It looks pretty crazy. Dude, what, what, what'd what you see? I don't, like, I don't know anything about that. That might be a mistake. No, I think I have to go down here. No, because just like the the way that the zombies are are done looks very interesting, and like they cl they're like climbing on top of each other to make like massive zombie ladders. Which oh is yeah, cool. I saw that. Dude, watching scary babies fall. Oh, down. these jerks! Yeah, it's getting worse every time. Running was not a terrible solution. The problem is they found me. Oh god, I don't know how, but they found me. Yeah, I don't think zombies would ever make bridges of themselves. It's a cool concept. It's cool imagery, at least. I guess they're kind of trying to get the idea that they have hive mind. Yeah, I think that's a big part of it. I don't think they would. But Possible. Maybe they did in a book or something. I heard it was not like the book, actually. Oh, yeah. No, it's totally different. But I, of course, I've never read a book, guys. Never read a book in my life. Yeah, that's true. Also, though... <sighs> um, you gotta quit letting them free hits, dog. Dude, it's tough maneuver. It's tough to maneuver. It's because they're in a movie theater and it's rad. It looks like it, though. Um, I think you did it. What else? Oh! Yeah, dude! You know what else is coming out this summer that looks like it's going to be really cool? We might have to find out in the next episode. We're going to find out in the next episode, but I'll, I'll tell you guys then. Alright, see ya.